An all-star hip-hop tribute kicked off television's biggest night. Who knew they had so much TV? Nominees sang and danced, declaring their love for TV. It's the Emmys, people! That's how we doing it! Tedrick, the entertainer, hosted the 73rd Primetime Emmy Awards from LA's Microsoft Theater. There is way too many of us in this little room. First presenter Seth Rogen jokingly complained about the venue, while Ken Jong poked fun at the pandemic. Dude, I didn't get four booster shots to present remotely. It was a good night for Apple TV's Ted Lasso. It won for Outstanding Comedy Series. Jason Sudeikis also won for Best Actor in the category. It, it means the world to me to be up here and just be uh, a mirror of what you guys give to me. The show also lassoed wins for supporting actor and actress. Netflix's The Crown took home an armload of trophies, including Outstanding Drama Series, Lead Actress, Lead Actor, Best Supporting Actor and Actress in a Drama Series, and Writing and Directing Honors. HBO Max's Hacks won several awards. The show's star, Jean Smart, dedicated her award for Best Actress in a Comedy Series to her late husband. I would not be here without him. There were also tributes for recently departed actors. And lastly, Weekend Update has been part of SNL for 46 seasons. And here I'd like to pay tribute to one of the best we ever had, Norm Macdonald. McDonald passed away last week, while nominated Lovecraft country actor Michael K. Williams died earlier this month. Last week tonight with John Oliver won for Best Variety Talk Show for the sixth straight year. It also won for Best Variety Series Writing. Thank you, uh, thank you so much. Glitz, glamour and high fashion were also on display on the red carpet. MJ Rodriguez paid homage to old Hollywood while Billy Porter entered the venue wearing wings. Anthony Pura, CBS News, Los Angeles.